I look fucking messed up right now. <laughs> this is me being hungover. Dude. Ugh. Okay. So guess who can't drink anymore? Me. Okay, so last weekend, um, got pretty drunk, had some drama. Um, this week went to the gym a couple times. And, yeah. I hit my goal weight. Oh, my God. I wonder who's messaging me. I hit my goal weight. I'm 150 now. So, yay to me. Um, I've been going through, like, a lot of emotional stuff lately. Uh, with me and Ron and the wedding and stuff. Um, anyways, I went out with my sister last night, uh, and I ate, because I wanted to try my theory out, because last weekend I got really drunk, and I was like, wow, I actually was really drunk, like, legit drunk, not just, um, not just feeling sick, like, I was drunk. Um, and then, so, I'm like, I think my body's processing liquor differently now, because before I used to be able to drink one or two, maybe three drinks, depending on what it is. Like, a, yeah, and I was fine. I felt sick, um, but I didn't feel drunk. And then last weekend, I was really drunk. So this weekend, well, it's my, right now it's Friday, but this week I wanted to go out with my sister, have a talk with her about a couple of things that happened last weekend. And um, I ate. I ate right before I went to have a drink um, and karaoke. And I drank a lot of water. Even when I was in the car on my way, I was drinking a lot of water. Um, and I had a lot of, like, I, I think I overate. <laughs> because I wanted to make sure that I didn't get drunk. And, yeah, that, I had a martini. I tried to um, have a white Russian, but it just was not tasting right. So I didn't have it after all. And then I had a shot of tequila, I think. And the point is, Ron had to come get me. <laughs> he had to come drive over there. My sister had to drive my car back to my house. Um, and my my Ronald had to drive her back to the bar to get her car. So I, I created a big mess. And I was being very stupid and very drunk and very angry at Ron. Um... Because I was drunk and I, I didn't realize I was that drunk. So, I have a lot of ass kissing to do to Ron because I he's great, and I acted like a total bitch. And I think that was like, I I honestly am surprised that I even got like fucking wasted. Like, so that right there tells me that I can no longer hold my drink at all. And I'm probably, maybe it's because of the weight loss. I don't know, like, this recent weight loss. Um, but no, I, <laughs> I can't handle my drink. And I think I shouldn't even drink. And if I do, it's going to be one really watered, at, watered down drink. Um, but yeah, um, I'm starting to realize, well, now that this is happening, I'm, I'm starting to notice what other people said about, having one drink and being super wasted. I'm pretty sure that I ha I yeah, I shouldn't have had another drink after my first martini. Um yeah. And isn't that weird? I I don't know why it changed now, but that's so weird and it's a year and a couple months out like and now it's starting to hit me that way. Like I don't know, it's weird. But I guess I should do, have a little mini celebration for myself that I hit my goal weight. My own personal goal weight because I, 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 I don't think I want to be 135, which is what my doctor wants. I don't want that. But yeah, I wanted to say congrats and I'm hoping that everything's going well so far to Kimmy and to Michelle who had their surgeries. Um, I, you know, messaged them and gave them a little bit of advice and I'm like super happy to see that they're going through with what they wanted to go through I mean yeah it's a scary thing but you know what ultimately sometimes you know the scariest thing to do is is probably the right thing for you if that even makes sense like myself for example anything that really scares me I try to take on head on like seriously 
Um, so when I had my surgery, I know I was terrified up until they rolled me into the operating room and put me on the table. I was still kind of freaking out. So totally normal to be scared beforehand. Um, but to this day, I can still say that I have no regrets about having the surgery, although it's caused a lot of changes in me. Um, I'm very excited about everything. Yeah. Um, I don't really have anything else to say. I'm feeling very crappy right now, very hungover, and I can't believe it. <laughs> I will log more next week. Bye, guys.